Hello everybody, so today I'm doing something a little bit of a video today, so I'm going to react to one of my old skit videos today, so at one point in my YouTube channel period, I used to make lots of skit videos and like little like shortish like videos, like me just like um, acting and doing skit videos and all that. It was so cringy. And I used to honestly think by like, making those videos that people would laugh at it and send it to all their friends and all laugh hysterically at it and I was the best skit video channel out there and people share it and I'll get a deal with like some acting company like I'll be like on a comedy show. Like I honestly thought those skit videos will take me somewhere but they yeah, aren't because they're very cringy. So I'm going to react to them today so that should be very exciting. Like it's, it's actually nice exciting because they're about to literally throw up just like watching half of these videos yes yeah, so but i just remember like going to all the effort as well of making these videos like i remember i didn't have a tripod at the time so i used to have to like do books and like stack like books on top of each other until i can get the camera high enough to be in a good angle and i used to have to make my own lights using my lamp and reading lights and stuff and then i used to have to do all the editing as well that used to take a lot of time as well so i did go to a lot of effort to make these videos but they're still really cringy so i'm gonna react to them today but yeah let's get into it shall we so if you're excited don't forget to like on this video subscribe shall do all the things and leave a comment on what we do until next time wow why did this spit just like flat my mouth then i think i'm talking way too much anyway i need to get started okay so here's my channel yeah Yes, it was itched my nose. I wasn't picking it, I was itching it because it was itchy. So here's the playlist of all the videos which I'm going to react to today. So that should be very interesting. So the first video which I'm going to react to is this My Apology video. So uh, about a few years ago, well actually a year ago actually, it was like on the first day of 2021, I made a video where I basically parodied like YouTuber apology videos, but then like made my own twists in it and apologised for all like the things I did, such like peeing the shower and you know doing all the like silly little crazy things. But and back then like social media influencers were always getting into scandals and stuff where you have to make apology videos. So I thought I would um, parody that and make this video. So um, let's have a look at this thing, shall we? <laughs> this video has been really hard to make, I'm not gonna lie. I've oh. been back and forth several times whether to make this video or not, but I thought it's only time to, you know, just... Alright, so all this here was literally, like, because I watch, like, YouTuber apology videos, and that's what they literally always open the video up with, saying something like... I've been thinking of, like, whether to make this for, like, several months now, but I'm gonna... Finally open up and make this video. So all the things I say in this video are literally just like copying of what the people say. What's up guys? Today I decided to do a video where I just open up about something today. You know, over the last year or so I've done loads of things, made many mistakes, things like which I just <laughs> sort of open up about today and, you know, just come forward to today. So that's what I'm going to do today. Obviously I do have a responsibility as an influencer to, you oh know, God. sort of, let's get started. My apology. Alright, let's get started. I'm sorry for all the terrible selfies I took with your Snapchat filters over the years. <laughs> To be fair, to be fair, I have a point. I do need to apologise for those terrible selfies because they were terrible. Especially uh, my, sna my old Snapchat selfies. Like, honestly, they were so tragic. I'm sorry for the terrible transitions when I try to do the Olivia challenge on TikTok. <laughs> I'm sorry for all the cringy, unfunny Instagram captions I captioned my photos with over the years. I will forever be sorry for this haircut. To be fair, I should be sorry for that haircut. That haircut was honestly tragic. Um, like I literally, this was like back in my like, mushroom hair days. Well, not so mushroom hair back then, but I had a haircut and the um, hairdresser, well, barbers actually, like the Turkish barbers, they cut my hair like so short and like left like a bit of hair on the top. So basically like bald, but with a bit of this hair. And obviously I didn't use a style it back then and he was supposed to like style it so it was like spiky and stuff, but I didn't. And so it ended up like having like a little like tiny like fringe. It honestly looked so terrible. So maybe I should apologize for having like no shame and like having my hair like that at, some, at one point. I'm sorry for these horrendous model shots as hook. Oh, I really God. thought I did something when I took those photos, but they are absolutely cringy. And I do, I'm just sorry about them. They are terrible. I'm sorry for this and this and this <laughs> and this and this and this and this. And this. I'm sorry that I have a serious, hardcore man oh, crush on Noah Beck. 
Well, actually, I'm not sorry that one because, I mean, who the hell doesn't have a crush on their bag nowadays? Like, if you look at this picture, I mean... Hello. Oh my god, okay, so the, the whole Noah Beck thing, so, um, this was made at the time when, like, Noah Beck was, like, kind of viral on TikTok, well, he still is now, actually, but literally everyone had a crush on him, like, he was literally one of the most attractive people out there, so if anything, like, it'd be weird not to have a crush on him at that time, because he was really attractive. Now, I'm not really attracted to him nowadays, but back then, like, he was everyone's yeah. But that crush lasted about a week. Okay, so I'm gonna look at another video right now. So this video is called If TikTok Sounds Were Used In Real Life. So if I remember rightly, I did a skit video where basically I pretended to go back my day but just use TikTok sounds. I think something like that, I'm not sure, but I remember being really cringy. So I'm gonna watch this right now. Today's actually a little more from the video today. So I've been really thinking these last few days of what would happen if TikTok sounds were in real life. So for example, we just did TikTok sounds, but in a real life sort of normal conversation thing, so <laughs> yeah. So um, yeah, that's the video today, so good quality content. <laughs> okay, I don't know why I've been doing these like weird videos recently, but... I don't know why either. Videos. Hi! Hi! <laughs> so, what's your name? Oh, my, my name's down to the B, which is... Oh, this is cringy! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! Oh my god, this was like back, like, ugh, this is so cringy, guys. Like, why did I think of making this? Like, what on God's green earth made me think that that was funny? Like, it's just terrible. Like, I'm literally sat here right now. I'm so uncomfortable watching this. Like, it's so cringy. Oh, that sounds like a good name. Can I ask a question? Of course. <laughs> have you ever been snaked by a friend and just looked like that will do it again? Oh, <laughs> yes, yeah, I have. I'll, I'll tell you from the story time about that now. So, how did you get snaked by your friend then? So my old friend had a dog called Marva, and you know, you know, he was just so Oh god. Dog. Okay, so I'm referring to the, like, TikTok sound where it used to go Marva was an Irish dog. He went rah, 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 something like that. And, um, it was back in, like, the whole, like, deep TikTok phase where people used to do, like, emojis after each word, and that was a really weird phase, by the way, but that's what I was referring to. That soup. And then my dog started going for the alphabet soup. Oh, I think I might know Marva, to be honest. I thought he was just some average dog, so I don't know why he would do that, but yeah, hello. But as soon as Marva went for the spaghetti and started drinking the alphabet soup, then oh, what happened next was very much bizarre. Oh, oh boy. Hi. Oh, hi. Are you seriously laughing at my butthole? Yes, your butthole looks very weird, I must say. <laughs> Buttholes are nothing to be laughed at, they're just- Okay, I remember this now. This has unlocked a lot of memories for me, so... Again, this was a part of, like, deep TikTok. Like, this was back in, like, the deep TikTok phase, but there was this, like, really weird video which goes... Buttholes are nothing to be laughed at. They're just a part of the human body. Like, this, like, really weird, like, person made a, like, video, and, um, it was all over TikTok. So that's what I was referring to here. Okay, someone's a little grumpy today. Okay, why, why can't we just relax and turn on the radio? What, and then listen to a bit of hmm and a bit of hmm? How about no thanks? Okay, I'm gonna um, look at some more videos now. So, I'm going to watch something now which is gonna be really cringy. So, this video which I'm gonna watch right now is dated back in 2019. Um, back in 2019, I was a different person. So, I should imagine the next few videos which I'm gonna watch are gonna be much more cringier than these videos. Like, I think I'm gonna generally gag watching these videos. Like, they are so bad. So this very video is titled, How It Feels Being Near Your Crush. So it basically is just like a skip video of how it feels being near your crush, apparently. Okay, Jamie, you're crushed in this room right now, so remember to be oh confident God. and do not care about what anybody else thinks. Oh my God, this is cringy. Oh God. <laughs> People look at me weird. Oh my god, did you know oh I'm crushing him? Oh this my god, is... this is literally the worst time ever. Oh my god, it's literally so awkward. I need to get out of here immediately. Oh what god, I'm gonna I do. Mean this. Oh my god, literally everybody's just looking at me weird. I'm trying to literally like try and pull like a straight face so nobody knew, but it just seems oh like god, everybody I knows. Hate oh my this. god, what I'm gonna do. This is so awkward. I cannot live. This is so now. crazy. Oh my god, what I'm gonna do. Okay, Jamie, you're fine. Nobody's looking at you. Everybody's all fine. It's all good. Just don't panic. <laughs> Everything will all be fine. Nobody's gonna do anything and your crush isn't gonna... 
do anything right now, so everything will be fine. Um, oh yeah. my god, my crush is literally sitting next to me. Oh my god, Oh this my is god, just... this is literally the worst day of my life. How am I going to do this? Everybody's looking at me weird. Okay, this is what baffles me. Why do people feel the need to just literally comment oh, on me if I have a so crush on me or not? Bad. What matter if I have a crush on somebody anyway? Anyway, I can't even remember that I'm that angry. Oh my god, this oh, is god. ridiculous. What's a world we live in where people are just judged for having crushes on me? Oh, oh god, I'm so angry. This like fake acting this is so bad. ridiculous. Now I can't even sit next to anybody right now because everybody's going to judge me. This is literally the worst thing in my life. Oh, Jesus. But, do us a way. If you tell your teacher you have a crush on somebody, then... Okay, so I'm presuming it, the, like, the, sips, like, the situation where you're in a class and like your crush sits next to you and the teacher like looks at you really weird. I think that's what the storyline is for, for, from this video. Hey teacher, yes. I think I have a crush on Michael. Alright, oh, okay. Yeah, I didn't want to tell you because I thought you'd react very differently, but that's fine then. But I'm obviously not. See, everything was fine. Nobody's bothered. Nobody's going to judge you for having a crush on somebody. Everything is all good in the hood. Hi, Jamie. Oh, yeah, I've literally shared the good news about your crush to Michael to the head teacher. Now, the head teacher going to share the good news to assembly because she thought oh. they were such great news <laughs> that it was worth mentioning to assembly. I'm just also going to tell the music company This as is well. so bad. And I'm just going to try and go on television as well. Oh my god, this is literally going to go viral. Great, now my life is literally not worth living right now. Don't I just love my life right now? No, my name will be officially Mud. Anyway, so last video now which I'm going to react to and boy. This is going to be bad. Morning routine expectations versus reality. So again, this video was made three years ago. Let's take a look, shall we? Jay's all TV here. <laughs> And today, I thought I'd do something different to my channel. Oh god, to so be fair, I actually love that background so much. I want to be like, I think, who was it? The Fine Brothers. So I remember like the Fine Brothers like used to make like reaction videos, but he'd always have like a really posh like background and like a really like organised programs on the YouTube channel and it always looked really good and really professional. I wanted to obviously recreate that, so I decided to make a background which I'd always film against and it was literally like a white bookshelf and also like a white like cube like storage unit and these like plants and flowers and pictures against it and to be fair it looks actually good so uh, I can't really say anything about that but um, I remember the reason why I had the background. I've been so I kind of contemplating on doing like these like skits recently I've, done, I've already done the modern routine in a few videos ago. Okay this is going to go on for a long time. time. Oh, that music! <laughs> oh god. This took a long time to edit, by the way, because I've had to use all the sound effects, not like the special effects in the video and stuff, so this took a long time to edit. <laughs> oh, that lighting. <laughs> Oh god. The fake Snapchat thing. Oh my god. Two thousand years later. <laughs> oh god, this is really bad. Is there any interesting parts? <laughs> this music is so loud. Oh. What was that dancing? <laughs> I don't know why I include that part in the video because this is meant to be like a morning routine expectations versus reality for like my morning routine and I never do dance in the morning like I never like try and dance in the morning like so I don't know why I included that part because it's meant to be like my morning routine expectations versus reality and I don't dance during the morning so um it was I don't know why I included that but I guess it was like I guess at the time it was kind of funny 
That camera work there is actually not bad. Okay, so I think that's all the videos which I'm going to react to today, so they were pretty bad. So my overall verdict on those videos were they were really cringy and they were really bad and I actually felt quite uncomfortable like watching those videos because they were so cringy and so bad. But I will say back in the day I used to like really think that those videos were really good and to be fair I used to put a lot of effort into these videos like the amount of hours I would like spend like making these videos and editing them like it was like a long time and so I really like was invested in making the like videos so no matter how bad they were I did use to put a lot of effort into it and I used to like I enjoyed it like I, en I enjoyed making these videos so much like I used to have so much fun making these videos so I'm not gonna forget that and actually I had quite good memories of like making these videos and like having fun while making them so I'm not gonna complain about that so yeah I'm gonna end this video here now guys if you guys are watching this video if you have don't forget to like this video subscribe shall do all the things and let me know if you want me to react to more of these videos because I've got loads more videos which um, I'd like to react to but yeah I'll see you guys whenever I see you through social media TikTok my vlog channel where I'm vlogging every single day don't forget to have a wonderful day or night whenever you're watching this and I shall see you guys in another video Bye.